A heart that is open to Christ will be open to those he loves. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Marion Stroud. The much prayed for film night at the Church Youth Club had finally arrived. Posters had been displayed all around the village, and pizzas were warming in the oven. Steve, the youth pastor, hoped that the film about gang members in New York who were brought face to face with the claims of Jesus by a young pastor would bring new recruits to the club. But he hadn't realized that a key football match was being shown on television that evening, so attendance was much smaller than he had hoped for. Sighing inwardly, he was about to dim the lights and begin the film when five leather-clad members of the local motorbike club came in. Steve went pale. The leader of the group, who was known as T-Dog, nodded in Steve's direction. It's free and for everyone, right, he said. Steve opened his mouth to say, Youth Club members only, when T-Dog bent down and picked up a bracelet with the letters WWJD, What Would Jesus Do, stamped on it. This yours, mate, he asked. Steve nodded, hot with embarrassment, and waited while the new guests found a seat. Have you ever been in Steve's situation? You long to share the good news about Jesus, but you have a mental list of the right people who would be acceptable. Jesus was often criticized by the local authorities for the company he kept, but he welcomed those everyone else avoided because he knew they needed him most. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Luke chapter 5, verses 27 through 32. After this, Jesus went out and saw a tax collector by the name of Levi sitting at his tax booth. Follow me, Jesus said to him, and Levi got up, left everything, and followed him. Then Levi held a great banquet for Jesus at his house, and a large crowd of tax collectors and others were eating with them. But the Pharisees and the teachers of the law who belonged to their sect complained to his disciples, Why do you eat and drink with tax collectors and sinners? Jesus answered them, It is not the healthy who need a doctor, but the sick. I have not come to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. That's today's scripture reading from Luke chapter 5, verses 27 through 32. Let's pray. Lord, please help us to see people through your eyes of love and to welcome all those you bring into our lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.